Adam, I'm going to not act surprised. Oops. Of course, now I am going to be surprised. The Taco Bell uh, gong says it's 534. It's 42 outside. True to my word. Over 40 degrees. Shorts. Does this, does this get you hot? Huh? Does that, does that get you hot? My white hairy knees. Does that get you hot? It's hot outside. It's 42 degrees. I don't think that's a record. There's too much to talk about. I've got to get to it. I hope I have everybody's stuff loaded up. <sighs> so unorganized. Adam loved the belch. He said it was classic. For real base, you got to have Diet Dr. Pepper. Scott, Diet Dr. Pepper. Adam loves that I look surprised every time. I did not look surprised today. I'm trying a different program. Instead of the Logitech out-of-the-box software, I'm using uh, Movie Maker. And I'm trying to change the bitrate to see if that will affect how YouTube sees it. Over the weekend, I will try to determine an optimal bitrate for YouTube to convert my WMVs into whatever the hell it is they present. I'm a Mac guy, so you're lucky that I'm able to make all this work at all on this uh, beautiful Lenovo laptop with camera by Logitech. Should I plug anyone else? Um, that's it. Comment from Facebook. Rich Berry. Hey, Rich, what's up? WTF. That's all he said. He provided no context. He just asked WTF. Rich, WTF back at you. Why don't you provide some context so I can answer your non-question or not. Comments from YouTube. Uh, how do I pronounce it? Boyd got, Boyd got, no, Boyd go to guy. Boyd got oh guy. You got an oh guy, Boyd? Anyway, he uh, decided that he liked it. Actually, he said, love it. Love it, Chris. Think I'll become a regular. Thank you, Boyd. Thank you. We're calling you Michael now. Thank you, Michael. We'll tell embarrassing stories about you later if uh, I don't get more comments. Chris from Canada, comment from YouTube. KFC, the menu varies regionally. He goes on to talk about Canada. I do not care about Canada. I don't care. Great. Fantastic. You have different food in Canada. I am shocked. Do you know we have different food in America, too? Chris also asks for a return of lunch of the day, an old feature from the W. You would be incredibly bored if we did it. It's always going to be Marochan, although the flavors are different. Today, lime chili with shrimp. 28 cents at Walmart. So I buy about a dozen of them at a time. Sooner or later, I will weave them all into wallpaper, much as I have done previously with my cup of noodles. But as you can see, I've been using all my spare time taping videos instead of art projects. Comment from YouTube from Doug. We don't need no stinking VU. Welcome back. I never left, but thank you, Doug. Let's give VU a shot. VU 2.0, the new VU, is coming Monday. We'll see what they got. Maybe they can get around the firewall problems I'm having. Or they will finally release the Android client, and I can do shorter one-question videos there instead of here. Although this may take over my life. Who knows? Doug adds, maybe it's my computer, but the sound is not synced, so you look like you're in a Godzilla movie. It's fine when I tape it, but I don't know if, again, maybe it's the bit rate. Maybe I'm making it too big by going 640 by 480. But I think in the conversion process, YouTube is taking my beautiful WMV and turning it into what you're having to watch. But it's not like there's a lot of movement, although I will do some now. Other than, you know, once you see my shirt, Timberwolves tonight. You can pretty much close your eyes or open another window and stop looking here and just pretend it's the radio. Speaking of the radio, I had a comment from Google Plus from Mike. Sans the belch. Sans the belch. You're actually already at the level of most talk radio people. You just need a catchphrase. Thank you. It's very kind. I've been talking to myself for years. Catchphrase. Very interactive. That's all I got. That's what I've been using for a while, though, although I haven't actually said it. So it can't really be a catchy phrase if you never say it. We'll work on that. If you have a better idea, let me know. 
Question from Mike. Do you think moderating a message board eventually led to your disillusionment with the wrestling recaps? In a previous life, I recapped wrestling shows. Moderating a message board did not lead to my disillusionment with wrestling. Wrestling led to my disillusionment with wrestling. It just got too awful, and there was only one company to cover, so there was no variety. I was tired of it. It was too much work, and that's why I stopped. And that's why I pretty much haven't gone back, except for occasional 13-week forays. Speaking of which, new, shows, new season of Jersey Shore last night. I watched it. I vowed I was not going to recap. I am going to hold myself to that vow. This season is going to be difficult to get through, and I would not be surprised if it's the very last one. By the way, Vinny's not leaving. He's not going to give up 100 grand an episode. Nobody's going to give up 100 grand an episode to leave the show. So let's just all calm down. Okay. Is that all the comments? No, because we have an oodle, oodle load. I'm inventing words even as we speak. From the W. Where am I? Six minutes. Oh, I better wrap it up. Although, Cerebus says eight minutes and he wasn't bored. He can admit me when he's wrong. I can admit when you're wrong, too, pretty easily. What's with the mutton chops, he asks. Chester A. Arthur would be jealous. On the same subject, have you considered cutting your long flowing hair or dyeing it? No, I will not cut my hair until at least July 4th. Because it's been three years on July 4th the past couple of times. Uh, I just let him grow, and this is what happens. J.J. Dean asks, uh, adds... I like the way the right one is pointed straight out while the left one hangs limply like a flag on a breezeless day. I don't care if you deny it, but in my mind, that will always be a conscious style decision by you. I can't control them. They always look different, and they always grow this way. I think it's because on the right side of my face, controlled by my left brain, left side of my face controlled by my right brain, so this is the creative side. This is the analytical side, and I don't know how my brain wave activity correlates to how these grow, but nonetheless... That's my theory, and I'm sticking to it. Cerberus has a question about Pokemon. Yes, I like Pokemon. We could talk more about that later. Cerberus also wants me to play with one of the many items on my desk. I think I'll wait and do that later as well. Let's revisit that. There's a lot of crap here for me to play with. I will let you know. Still working. January 6th, Friday. What else we got? Pie Man. Even at eight minutes, it did not get boring at all. Well, we're going to test that again when we're almost up to eight minutes, and I'll bet you're bored by now. Pie Man wants me to, let, to know he's drinking Moxie. I'm jealous. There's actually a Moxie in my fridge I need to drink. And this led to a question, not a question, but a discussion on the W about Moxie, a discussion that I'm not involved in. I hate when you guys talk amongst yourselves in a thread about me. Come on, man. No, that's great. You can talk about Moxie all you want. There's Doug again. Boy, Doug's all over the place. And that's also Moxie. You're all talking about Moxie. Oh, okay. If you're missing out, you got to go to the W. You can read all about uh, this exciting thread about Moxie. If you don't know where the W is, if you don't know where VU is, if you don't know how to reach me on Google+, if you don't know how to follow me on Facebook, CRZ.net. Everything's at CRZ.net. I make stalking me incredibly easy. I put it all in one place, crz.net. There's also a bunch of other addresses, but that's the one I'm plugging. So, I believe that's it. And by God, that's enough. That'll do it for this week. Since I'm only doing this at work, don't expect me to do this Saturday or Sunday. I'll be back Monday. Before we do that, I will give you my predictions, uh, the wildcard games. Because you didn't ask, but I know you're dying to know. Who do I like? I like the Packers. The Packers aren't playing. Cincinnati versus Houston. I don't care. We'll go with the Texans because they're at home. Pittsburgh, Denver. Ha! Denver's at home, but I will go with Pittsburgh. I don't believe in Tebow time. I do believe in God, but I don't believe in Tebow. Atlanta takes on the Giants. We'll go for the Giants at home. Detroit takes on the Saints. Hmm... Saints will probably win, but I'll be rooting for the Lions. So I hope Dave uh, stuck around long enough to hear me say one time in my life that I'm rooting for the Lions. That is it. Before I get to 10 minutes, and I'm not going to get to 10 minutes, thank God. Thank you so much. It's been a fun week. We will do even better next week, I promise. So long for me and my Dr. Pepper. Goodbye. <laughs>